Today we're going to take a look at the AI image tool inside of Niches. Now, Niches was my first AI tool and I absolutely love that it continues to get updated, improved. The outputs are pretty impressive in my opinion, and you can still get it from AppSumo on the lifetime deal. But today we're going to look at a new feature. It was added a couple of weeks ago, maybe called AI image. We can describe our image and get an image from text. Now you get 25 image generations per month. That's the current limitations of it. It's using Dolly 2, and if you want an additional 15 images per month using Dolly 2, you can head over to openai.com. You can create an account, log in, sign up. They give you 50 free image generations of Dolly 2 at first and then 15 per month, and you don't even have to buy niches to do that. Now let's get started today with describing an image, and I think I'm gonna do something like a portrait of Bugs Bunny. I've seen people specify the lenses and stuff, and they say that it might generate better overall images. Now for style, we can go through different styles if we have something in mind. I'm gonna leave that blank right now. We can also tell it if we want oil paintings or pastels, watercolors, spray paint, anything like that. I'm gonna leave it blank for now, and I'm just gonna click Get Content. I'm prompted with this warning that it's heavily used. It could take 30 seconds to a few minutes. That's not Bugs Bunny. That is a bunny, but that's not Bugs Bunny. Let's try it one more time and we get another bunny. I'm gonna get rid of the lens and let's try it one last time before moving on to something else. So far, Dolly 2 is, and I've heard by all accounts, Dolly 2 is better than Stable Diffusion. So far, I don't think so. I mean, that's at least getting close. I, I went ahead and clicked it one more time. 25 credits is gonna go way too quick. Now let's see if it can do something like an airbrush character of Joe Rogan. Let's try it one more time, just character. I'm not able to get that. It might be because of Joe Rogan. You might not be allowed to do celebrities with Dolly too. Let's do a panda riding a bike. You know, tw 25 image generations just is gonna go way too quick. Canva, you can do uh, 24 per day and they're giving you four each time. This is only giving me one. So it's very cool that this is included in niches. I'll leave a link in the description, but I read this guide today, the Dolly 2 prompt book, and I kind of assembled some prompts of what I thought would be cool. We'll go to Old Reliable, a pug in a suit. That's been the one that I've started off my other two videos on AI art so far. It's the most, I think, at least reliable, generic pug in a suit. Now let's go with like a photo of a female. I specified the age. I got this prompt from that guide, this guide right here, and I kind of tweaked it slightly. And that's, that's okay. It does have an animated look to it. Let's do Iron Man drinking coffee with the Incredible Hulk. And I'm going to go one more time with that. Let's go a penguin on the beach. Now we're going to change the style and go digital art. I'll be honest. I kind of read that guide, I wrote some prompts, and I thought I was going to get better results than I'm getting. This is a little bit disappointing. And it's not Niche's fault. That right there is a lot better. So me coming in and giving it the style, I would highly recommend you do that before you burn, you know, almost 20 images. Let's go with Pug Astronaut in Space Digital Art. And I do like that one a lot better. I would probably remove this background and rearrange it somehow. We could do the same with like a monkey. That's one that I've seen online and that definitely works. Now let's do an AI brain, futuristic high tech. I'm kind of thinking like this could be some inspiration for like a background image. And that's exactly what I'm looking for. And this is very similar to the description that I gave it. Futuristic high tech, neon teal on dark background moody. So these are some of the attributes that I got from this guide. And that is Santa drinking coffee. I don't know if photography, I mean, I guess you get the bokeh here. It does look more like a painting to me. Yeah, that didn't nail it at all. Let's, let's try our very last image generation, digital art, Michael Jordan taking game winning shot. I mean, that's like like a, that's not a photograph. That's a painting or some sort of a, I don't know what you would call it. So here it says, thanks for trying it out and we'll be able to generate more in 30 days or less. I was pretty confident coming in and leaving. This one here is my favorite, a penguin on the beach. This one definitely works. We're gonna go ahead and download that. It will upscale it before it downloads, which is gonna give you a better overall image. That is a pretty high quality image all in all. So I'm gonna get out of here now. This was a little bit disappointing for me. I absolutely love niches. I think it's fantastic to add the 25 image generations per month. 
I would set my expectations fairly low. Maybe I had them a little bit too high today, but if you need more, you can go directly into OpenAI and you can get 50 free image generations as well as 15 per month from OpenAI. And then you can also access Dolly 2 in Raku, which is probably what I'll be looking at next. Hopefully this video brought you some value. Subscribe if you want to see more content like this. My name is Scott with AI Profits and we'll see you in the next one.